What is up, Legend Scion? We're back and we're gonna rock out Street Fighter Duel. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna teach you guys pretty much how to get stronger in this game. Um, hopefully you guys have followed the guide that's in the Discord to pretty much learn how to make an account um, freely and legally so you can get in and actually play yourself. Now, this game actually works a little bit different than a normal gotcha. It has gotcha, of course, but the way that you actually use your characters, you have to be a little bit mindful of what they are, who they are, basically, and the links that they have working with them. Now, not every character works with each other. You can have, like, all of the meta characters in the game, and they just won't work with each other because some characters will be linkers, some characters will be starters, some characters will be enders. Like, you can't have a whole team full of meta enders. That's not going to work. You're going to get beat up by the PC and by other um, players because you won't be able to stop anything. Um, for example, if you have a, a bunch of characters who are all um, enders, and enders, what I mean, is kind of like what Guile is. Guile is pretty much an ender and a starter. The problem with that is he can't really combo break anybody, and he can't link very well. It's really hard to make him link with other characters. So kind of think of like Final Fantasy Brave Exodus, where you have characters who have attacks that are very good with linking, and mean they attack multiple times so you can get other characters in and do pretty lit characters. It works the same way in this game. Characters are linkers in this game, and some characters just are not. And Guile is one of those characters, he's not a linker. He, just, he attacks too slow, he starts up too slow, and like it's just not working. Now, uh, this character is who do everything, which is like Ryu. Ryu is a character that does everything. The problem with Ryu is his damage is not that high. So you can do all that if you want to, but he is like him being great, but not really putting in the deeps where you really need him to put in the deeps. He can end, he can start, he can combo link. It, like, he's a really good character, but he starts to fall off. Like, I start, I got rid of him, like, around when I was level 25, because it's just, he, there was other characters who were just doing better. Same thing with Cammy. Cammy can do everything. Cammy could break. Cammy could link. Cammy could start. Her specials are great. She's a good um, support character coming in. That's why she's in the breaker slot. That's pretty much what that slot is. That means that you can actually call this character in and she could be a breaker. She can actually continue a combo pretty well. Um, it's pretty much a, a support slot, like kind of like how other games work. But in this game, for me, I call it the breaker slot because whoever comes in at that slot needs to be good at breaking because they're gonna be exposed. You can call this character in and they could die. Now technically that's your fourth character, but if they're not good at breaking and they just run out there and do some sore ass attack, they can get absolutely like surprise butt sex basically and it don't be it don't be nice with them. Now I found the best character in this game who's a breaker, there's two of them who is the best I found so far. Not you. Um I can't show it right now. Um the Capri. I showed it in the um, earlier videos that Capri had so much move priority in her moves. Like, she is so ridiculous. And if she is, like, I've seen it with PvP as well. If she catches you in her breaker, like, from first contact all the way to the end, she can kill somebody. She's done it to me. She's done it to me against the computer when you fight against her. She is the most dangerous character in this game when it comes to the breaker slot. If you see, if you're fighting the computer and she sees, you see she's in the fourth slot, be careful because she's gonna come out there and screw you hard. And her special, if she is the fourth character attacking, I don't know if she gets a buff or something like that, but she does a crap ton of damage as the fourth special attack. Like it's ridiculous how much damage she does. But yeah, Dao Sim is an ender. That is all he is. He is not a starter. <laughs> he's a buffer too, but he's an ender. Like he just can't, which makes sense for him and everything. Like it's Dalsa. Like he's not gonna come out here and be, be combo heavy. It doesn't work like that with Dalsa. Um, all right. So as far as gaining power, you need to actually pay attention to all of the individual items that the game puts in front of you. So number one right here, 
is your achievement system for your characters. Now, as you rank up or get a plus one or plus two or so, so on and so forth, you get power. So you're gonna notice right here, this one, um, Dowsum is plus one. And you see I have 900 health and 900 attack. Now that's universal to all your characters, not just Dow 7, it's universal to all your characters because I got him that plus one, so he, he's chilling right there. Actually, he's at zero, I'm sorry, he's at zero. The plus one is when you go over. Um, but simply getting the character and activating them gets you the 990. So you see so you move over, the same thing like with C Viper. I pretty much got her, she got the 990. Um, Gaio, Abuki, she's at plus one, so she has the 440, but you see, she's not uh, um, a high level character, she's only a B, so the bonus on that is not that great. But don't sleep on these too much. All of this adds up. This all goes on top of your power. So you definitely need, could pay attention and need to pay attention to actually doing this. It's, it's not a bad thing. You also have in this section right here, uh, when you get certain characters together, they have a team passive. And when you put the team passive together, you get these rewards right here. Now, um, this is stuff that I could get right now. Obviously, as you can see, I don't have all these characters um, and I missed out on the, um, the evil Ryu one. But this is what you get for all that. And you see what I have received. These characters that I'm still missing, obviously. All right, so that's how you uh, build a little bit of power on that. And you also have the screen right here. I, I found this particularly cool, especially how, look at, look at M. Bison. M. Bison looks like a One Piece character. He looks kind of cool. Look at, look at Chun-Li. Chun-Li's outfit right there is also next level. And Blanca, they need to use Blanca. Look how cool Blanca looks right there. He, he's not all emo and crazy and everything else like that. They got Sakura looking like she's like eight. But yeah. Um, you know, I'm, they're missing Karen. We need Karen in this game. She'll probably be later though. All right, so let's talk about the passive area. All right, so wow, everything is ready. Uh, the passive area is pretty much where you farm EXP to level up your characters. As you can see, um, I have a bunch of stuff ready, so we're gonna go in. We have the middle shrine right here, which is like your big EXP. Um, you put the EXP scroll in here, and it's gonna give you a thousand per hour for I believe 23 hours, or maybe 20 hours, maybe 23 hours, one or two. Um, you can combine the, um, to level up your books if you have a whole bunch of books like I got. If you have some trash books or if you have books that um, give different things, you see I have a bunch of books that give different things. But I have many of the high level ones right now because I gave it to in the event. So yeah. Uh, when you are a friend with other people, you can send certain characters over to go farm EXP into other places, which you see Dowson, that's what he's doing now. And when the, um, my friend people shines. All right, very first up, we have the punching bag, and you see uh, Yang and C Viper over here training. As you train and get uh, your character stronger, the individual area can level up. So you see, I can actually level this up as soon as I'm done with this. I can't do it right now, but as soon as I'm done, bam! So now I can level it, bam! And now it'll easily um, go up to this and I get even more benefit from leveling. And you can automatically do this and it'll put you know, characters back in the same slot again, whoever's the best for the area. And it's back to training again for them. And she runs over and does that. Um, this is tandem training. I would need more friends. Um, I only have like two friends right now who, who friended me right now. and they would have to come in here and actually do the same thing too so I can accept them. But you get a bunch of EXP doing that so everybody who plays is friend each other and then get together and request each other in this individual section right here and you get a bunch of extra EXP to level your characters which is really good because that helps in the area that I showed you before where you need to plus up your characters because the more EXP you have obviously the more characters you can level up and plus up and then the more passive power you get. All right, so down right here. Do the same thing right here. We can level this up. Do it multiple times, yay. All right, and then we'll bring in, uh, all right, so I need, OK, 
Okay. So that means Hakka can't be there then, right? Do I have to plus up Hakka? I do. Yeah, I got to plus him up. I just got him, so. So let's go do that now. Alright. Not gonna cost me that much anyway. Alright, let's do that. Let's get him up to 30. I wanna use him eventually anyway. Alright, we leave it right there. Alright, so now he's ready. Bam. Super easy, right? Alright, so over here the barrel toss. Uh, let's finish this. We have Dowsome and Jay doing this. Get two slots on this. Now we get the increased power. Um, the what actually is needed as you level the cat I mean the the individual areas up makes you need higher and stronger characters too so keep that in mind when you level one up these things maybe you necessarily won't necessarily want to do that because you not have any characters that are um able to fit into that slot or not built yet but it's not that hard to build stuff early it'll get a little bit more daunting later on okay they're done Alright, so the Capri and Jun. Alright, so everything is pretty much good. Um, we got this benefit right here, yes. Let's see if I can actually do this properly this time and get some stuff. Alright, so it's really? Really? Alright, hey then. There we go. Got some Zam parts. Ooh, Jun. Uh I don't care about the damn. I wanted to mess with them. Oh, we don't need any of this. So to get that blue. Damn, nothing good. I'm running out of time. I don't want no damn Dan. Oh, I want this can right here. Give me that can. Really? Okay, um, maybe Dow. I mean, um, Blanca. No Blanca. This is always hard for no reason. <laughs> anyway. Alright, so we did get a Zaggy part in Judd. It is, um, you could do this necessarily better, but. Like, I think, like, the most ever guy there is, like, seven pieces. It's, it's annoying. Because sometimes it, like, it works and sometimes it doesn't. Alright, let's go to J section. The only reason why I don't really show you this is because he starts singing his songs and I know that's gonna flag. So I'm like, bro, no. I'm good. But you can use his event. Because I'm not, I'm not particularly gonna use him, but his event gives all this free stuff here. So... Take advantage of it because it's free stuff, and why not? That EXP. So thanks, Jay. I heard he really is like a really, really big Street Fighter fan. Cause I looked it up on why they actually used him, and he's like a mega Street Fighter fan. So that's pretty cool. All right, so we're at 280 right now. Still working on that. Ooh, we get, we get to do this again. Oh, this. There's only one point for that? That's lit. I'll take it. Um, that's a steal. Definitely go in there and do that. I didn't realize there's gonna be one point every day. Alright, so what are we up to right now? We did that. Um, we have this section. This is the also the passive EXP section. Now you can actually level up your individual uh, elements here. So you have wind, you got forest, you have fire and mountain. I don't have the last one yet. And then there's darkness right there as well. And those are the individual areas. What you can do is you can put characters of those elements in here and you see you get those particular passes right there on the bottom. Same goes 
So right here it has to be the same element. Same right here. And right here. Um, the better characters that you put in the slot, the more um, passive stats that you get. Um, you can put characters there that you want to put there, but it's going to warn you and say, hey, you're not getting your possible, like your maximum possible power. And you see at the top, there is the maximum power that I'm getting right now for those characters being in there at this point. And it's up to 51,000 just for right here. And that's pretty much the motorcycle area or part of the motorcycle area. So now you have the bike and um, this is Ken's bike and you can level up these individual areas as you can see and there's a raid for that as well that so you need to level the oh we didn't level this do i even have a part to i don't have any parts to level it yet so i'm gonna have to do the raid to go get parts but all this is maxed right now except for that one part down there and then i get this next slot at 37. all right and we have our ultra skill now ultra skills can level up based off of investigation. Investigation is part of Chun-Li's event, where she's investigating Shadow Law, it's right here. This is survival mode. And what you do in this is you pretty much have to go in here and fight enemies and you're fighting like other people's accounts and stuff like that. So it's gonna get to a point where stuff starts getting tanky, which is what happened to me. And I'm up against some strong ass people and majority of my characters are already knocked out <laughs> like and so now it's like my backup team like you see that all these characters are knocked out because you have to keep fighting stronger and stronger people and you know that's what happens so pretty much i'm left with Dalsim, adon ryu and dudley which is fine um but you know after what I'm gonna do is I'm matter of fact, just do it now. I'm gonna lose because I'm up against it. This is like this is not even the B team. This is like the C team. Get out of here, kid. All right. Back them up. Thank you. Now, if you want a, a good character to be some cheese, oh god, he has Sea Viper. I I have her. I know what that's about. Fei Long is a excellent character. If you get Fei Long, you can carry early until you get some S rank. All right. We hanging in there though. Fei Long is carrying. Fei Long, uh oh, Fei Long is absolutely carrying. We might be. Damn it! I have nothing left now. Let's let's Z reversal that. Get him! Hey! I love Fei Long. And Fei Long, the reason why Fei Long is so good is because he has super armor. He don't care. He don't care. He just goes through everything. And oh my god. Makoto? You want to- oh. Man, I see the Capri. I'm already upset. And everybody on his team is level 80. I don't have much left, do I? Alright, Fei Long is less than half. Dalsim is still looking strong. Um, so from here, what you could do, being that the game counts it, is you can actually go and level up characters and the background to come and push through this. I have a day and change right now, so I can actually go level up Jay and DiCapri. And um, we have Yang too, and Hakan. Um, Sakura is actually good, but she's like Ryu. She doesn't have a lot of power. Like, she's a good linker. She's good at everything, but no power. Um, same thing with Fubuki, but Buki's a really good breaker. So, a Buki can just come out there and screw somebody's combo all up and knock them down, which is hilarious.
and she'll be safe on top of that because she's in the damn air throwing them shurikens. So that's a BS all the way around, but yeah. So there's that. Um, you also have your training, which I kind of like neglect the hell out of it. I need to actually go in here and finish this because this is just free currency that I'm not doing. But yeah, you go ahead and knock this out. Don't forget that um, all of this coincides with Ken's event, which is only has one day left after that. And I'm almost at the point right now where I have Ken fully broken, which leads you to getting this version of Ken, which is like God mode Ken, the S rank Ken. We got to get there. God mode Ken all the way, baby. This fireball right here is ridiculous. He's just so good for no reason. He's like a tank in um, a scrapper DPS at the same time. So it's pretty cool that they give you this path. And plus you get so much currency for stuff here. I want I want to get to 115, but I don't think that's going to happen. I only have a day. And there's, there's still a lot of stuff that I need to, to get through that I don't think that I'm going to get through. Especially not this. Like, ain't nobody getting all the way to the because Evil Ryu would be on some BS. Alright. I will at least get him the S rank. So, just that. Can be chilling. So, pretty much, I think that's about it. Other than we have, this is the daily section right here. And I pretty much did all the daily stuff, as you guys can see. There's another book. Level 35. Nice. A lot of stuff that opens up at 37. I'm pretty excited to get there. So always make sure that you come in here because this is always going to be beneficial to you. Bunch of free stuff in here. It's rewarding me for beating all those tracks, which is pretty good. I like that. This game rewards you for playing. I love games that reward you for playing. All right, so now we have this slide up. Um, we can throw Yang in there. Yeah, I have to level him anyway, so. That improves my stat. And, um, of course, a level with him and getting him stronger will increase all of this. So, let's rock it out right now, real quick. And then we'll summon and then that'll be it. I'm trying to, I'm like, I could literally talk and teach in this, like, all day because this game is so interesting and so in depth. If you're a fighting game fan, this is like heaven. It's like it's like um, Street Fighter and Final Fantasy put together. All right, got him up to five star. His breaker. And it's a linker on top of that. So he pretty much does what the Capri does. That's that's great. The good thing about Yang is I think you're getting it. He everything he does is a breaker. He's knocking you down. No matter everything. That is ridiculously good. You do that. I don't have any um, any prisms for him right now, but that's fine. What was Cody? Cody, what do you need? Oh, you can break. Mm, I'm not interested in Cody. Cody's kind of lame. All right, so we can actually open this up too now. And we can bring in characters. I don't have any. I don't have, wow, I don't have any light characters? Who's light anyway? Who is light? That's particularly interested. Yeah, scrapper, but. Hmm. I 
All right, so let's summon. I know they ain't trying to say Zangief is. No, he's not. One second. I, I, I'm, we're, we're gonna summon. I'm, I'm particularly interested to see who, who's the light unit. Definitely not Seth. Wow, really, T Hulk? I guess because he's an Indian. T Hulk and Elena. Okay. That's interesting. Isn't Elena in this? This was upsetting because they wouldn't they wouldn't let me get evil Ryu. It said I was um I had him already and I'm like, what are y'all talking about? I don't have it. I even translated it and it literally said I have the character already. And I'm like, I don't freaking have the character. What the hell is this game talking about? And it just timed out after that. But like I said in the previous video, it's like they gave us compensation for that. So I'm assuming that it was broke. Also, you notice right here that this is coming. Um, I don't know. This time right here, I was here for this. And I noticed that people just ran in there and I clicked the button and nothing happened. And I was like this and I noticed that all this popped up. So I was like, how the hell am I supposed to get in? Unless they killed him in a little bit of time that I was um, looking at it, which could happen. But we'll try again tomorrow. That's seven o'clock for you guys who, um, for you guys who, um, who may not, I mean, not, I'm sorry, eight o'clock. It's 8 o'clock for you guys who, you know, if you want to, when you get and want to play to get play this, it's 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time when we're supposed to be able to get in and do this. So I don't, I don't know what happened because it's still within that time. Because you can see right now that uh, the it's 23 six, so we're still within that hour, and I can't get in, so I don't get it. So whatever. Uh, okay, let's go summon and actually, no, we're gonna go to the shop first. Like I was telling you, it's better to go in here and do this because you're gonna get 11 instead of doing it out there. So, when I have the opportunity, I'll do it that way. Unless I don't, I'm cut for time, then I'll do it the other way, but you know. So, we got the summons, let's go ahead in. Uh, what did that do? I got achievements for spending currency. Thank you. Anyway. <laughs> it's disappointing because I, I'm not gonna, there's no shot at Evil Ryu, but I do want the dupes. Um, can I just? So we'll do it backwards. See what happens. Oh, speak of the devil. Got a dupe of him. I want Elena. Oh, we get freaking Abel. I'm cute. No, I'm not buying poison. And that what I just did. Oh, they gave it to me because I did it. That's cute. Let's see if we get any parts. That right, good. What did, Yang? Do you like? Are you giving me a hit, Yang? That is that what's going on right now? How much Makoto parts do I have? It broke ass. Ooh. Poison in the Honda part. I like how they give you parts too. Like they just they hook you up in this game. They really hook you up. All right, so nothing on Ken. We unlocked the new person, so we're gonna get the power for that and the currency, as you can see. I think that's it. We just got Abel. Uh, I'm not probably gonna use Abel. Uh, Two more days, I can get E Honda. So E Honda's a tank. 
and I went either either E Honda or Zangi because Hugo is not doing it for me. <laughs> so yeah. I will catch you guys next video. We're at 30 minutes on the dot. Hope you guys enjoyed and you got use out of this and hope to see you in game. Peace.